Hey everybody, this is Jeff Butch from the Mac Observer, and I'm with you to bring you another tip on how to use iMazing, which is one of the best apps there is for managing your iOS device. Now, a lot of times when you're trying to clean up your device, you might decide you want to delete a whole bunch of apps at once. Just because you've installed them, you don't use them anymore, it's time to get rid of them. If you do this from your iOS device, it's a real pain. You have to tap each one and say that you want to delete it. Um, iTunes has taken this ability away from us now with 12.7. So let's see how we can do that in iMazing. You just launch the app and I like to have my device plugged into a USB port for this but you don't absolutely have to do that. This will work just fine over Wi-Fi. One of the icons that you'll see either in the information summary of your device or in this drop-down menu is apps. So click on that, wait for it to load, and then you go through and locate the apps that you want to delete. Let's see what I have here. I don't play that game anymore. Test flight I use, text expander. I don't use your being rude anymore. Let's see what else do I have that I might want to get rid of. To select multiple apps, you can either press down the command key as you click, or you can press the shift key. Either one will work, even though technically shift should select a, a group, a line of apps. It doesn't work that way in iMazing, and that's okay. So I've got a couple of apps selected here. Now I'll go ahead and click on delete. And it asks me if I'm sure I want to delete the first one in the list, which was events. If I just click yes, it's going to ask me that for each app. So I'll click on apply to all, then I click yes, and it's deleted all three apps just as fast as that. So that's how you go about deleting your apps in bulk using iMazing. Stay tuned for more tips and tricks for iOS 11, uh, iTunes, and iMazing. Thanks guys.